YouTube. I got more Packmaster content for you. Finally, after all this time, you had to wait, what, like a week for it? Oh my God. <sighs> How dare I make any other content? <laughs> Either way, this was actually just on a random stream. I wanted to just try out some of the packs that we hadn't really messed around with. Uh, I had played one run before this with a couple of the packs, and I lost miserably. It was it was bad. But, I mean, we've played so many runs of the Packmaster now that we're getting up into the teens of Ascension levels, and that's where things start getting difficult, and not every run win is guaranteed. But either way, I try to do my best to, to make sure that you understand what I am doing. Either way, I hope you enjoy the content. If you do, give it a like, the comment, and subscribe. If you haven't already, uh, yeah. Comment down below and uh, tell me um, <clears throat> what your favorite vegetable is. Mine is broccoli. And if you disagree with me, um, argue about it angrily in the comments. I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah. We are playing a pack master run today. We could do all random. I just want to play with new packs, man. I just want to play with packs that I haven't seen and we still have so many. I, you know what? I really want to play with Goddess of Explosions. Everybody tells me how fucking awesome that one is. Let's do choice of three, choice of three. Choice of three. Bulwark strikes goddess of explosions. Content time. Cat, be on your best behavior. Do you understand? Oh, back on the goddamn bullshit. Serpentine discipline. The disciple of the reptomancer uses venomous and cunning stanches, which focus on applying debuffs. Okay. I'll be the Reptomancer. Replicators, multiplier cards and strive for a big deck full of value or graveyard. A pack for burying your cards or unburying them. I feel like chat is gonna want replicators more because it's got goofier art. Graveyard, 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 each. Okay, we're gonna take jewelers. Pure support pack contains zero cost gems that can be placed in your other cards. They cost one or more at rest sites. Yeah, I mean, we're just gonna take any, any, we're always going to take anything that we see if we do not have the, the hat unlocked. Did someone say empty the wallet? Stop rizzing us. What does that mean? Anyways, uh, Bulwark this is one of the packs that we started off with as one of the newer ones. Uh, the greatest defensive tools of the Spire T came together for the first time in the same place. Uh, we also took Strike, Strike, Strikes. It deals six damage. And Goddess of Explosions. Power! Value! Explosions! Strong scaling powers and non-attack damage cards. Are you guys ready for some content? You guys ready for some pogs? Oh no. I appear to have dropped this. Oh yeah. well. Oh well. Oh well. Oops, I forgot to pay my content tax. Oh well. Damn. Can somebody go pick that up real quick? Hey, this path is incredibly good. <laughs> that path is so good. I love that path. Jesus Christ. Well, that's I can't. weird wallet size. <laughs> I, 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 I actually can't focus when you guys are around doing that shit, man. I can't. Explosion! I can't, I can't, I can't focus with this shit, man. I can't, I can't focus, dude. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Gain seven block. Next turn deals seven damage or nine damage to all enemies. Workers strike. <laughs> Communism. <laughs> I am nothing if not an obedient dummy mommy. Oh. I was told to empty my bit wallet. Ooh. Thanks. Deal six damage. Draw an attack. If it's a strike, gain one energy. Cheer 100 oops. I mean, I kind of just like a card that deals damage and also draws. And it'll be good in the early game. Zen, thank you for the five gifted subscriptions. Appreciate that, dude. Thank you. Holy! A smithing oil? That's incredible. Wait, a juggernaut's here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. More explosions. Shuffle two random powers into your draw pile. Came More explosions. That was 1,000 bits. Okay. I, what are you guys doing, man? I'm... Be on your best behavior. Do you understand? I mean, we have a smithing oil. We can take the juggernaut and upgrade it, so... It seems quite incredible. I do say so myself.
Or explosions could be anything. It could even be a juggernaut. That's true. Did you see that combo, though? Gain 12 block at the start of your next turn. Two turns, draw a card? Wait, I love this card so much. Preparation. Choose an attack or skill card. Add a copy of it to your hand. It's also cool. Deal four damage two times. Hits an additional time if you are in a stance. Dagger Hearing rush. Frost mold sounds cool. like. Is that what it sounds like? Is that... I don't think that's what it sounds like, man. I'm going to give him a defend. So our worker strike goes off a couple more times. That was creepy as fuck. Yeah, what the hell was that, man? Let's take the elite fight. I'm not fucking scared. Yeah, I should have put it on top. What am I doing? Why did that sound like crickets? What crickets are you hearing that sounds like that? Please tell me. Like, I'm actually serious. Please tell me what crickets you're what, what crickets are you hearing? Are they chain smoking crickets? Dude, I love this red shift, man. It's like some good passive draw in the background. It's kind of cool. Oh, it says draw an attack, and I didn't have an attack. Interesting. All right, so far, Juggernaut not doing terrible. So far, Juggernaut not being asked. That is incredibly cool. Preparation again. Wave of the hand again. Start of your hand, gain a card from a pack not available in your draft, and it gains ethereal. Wait, you guys just want to go pog mode? You guys just want to go fucked up pog mode? Fuck it, man. Let's upgrade it. Make it cost zero. <clears throat> Thread and needle. That's uh, free damage every turn with a juggernaut. Let's upgrade the cardistry. Amber, unplayable gem, card gains, retain. Interesting. So yeah, so you can attach a gem to any card that costs one or more. Dude, a level six hype train? Fuck you guys. Two uses? If you upgrade it, you can attach it to two things. At the end of your turn, if you are in a stance, gain 10 block. Exit your stance at the start of the turn. Thank Trinity you, Core, thank you for the six thank months. Thank, thank you for subscribing. Muda, muda, muda. Love you, Frost. And you too, Andrew. You too, Poggy Andrew. Front-loaded base. Deals six damage. Deals one more damage for every three cards in your draw pile. Lightning strikes. Interesting. Arbiter Daydream. Think of the five gifted. We're not going to level seven. Don't even try. I think we could potentially get really cool stuff by going here. And then going here. <clears throat> we could potentially get a really cool run going on. Thank you for subscribing. Yeah. I, of course, want to get Juggernaut off. No, defense, de de Defenstrator. Thank you so much. I appreciate the fuck out of you, dude. Thank you. Kage. Thank you. Jesus Christ, man. Just 15 seconds left. I sleep and I know that I can't sleep anymore. It is currently 1130 p.m. for me. <clears throat> so fuck me, I guess. Also, fuck you. I love yeah. Chip's new toy with. It's over, Chad. The hype train is dead. The end of your turn, when freeze the highest car card in your hand. Frost Prime no. TTS POV to study to. Just hours of moves and bing bongs and all uh -huh. the chat dumb stuff. Yeah. I could do that. You're not wrong. I could do that. Just 10 hours of mooing. Would you guys like that? The end of your turn, exhaust a random card in your discard pile and gain five block. No! Wait, these cards that we're getting are ass, man. <laughs> These cards that we're getting, I don't like. <clears throat> the end of your turn, if you have fully blocked any source of damage gain. One strength! Very cool. Gain three vigor, gain two temporary dexterity. Okay. 
Can I do an overexplained on my chat? Yes. They say moo sometimes. Gem, roll a d6. So when I play this card, I also roll a d6. I mean, that's kind of sick, man. Draw one card. Choose a card. Exhaust that card and add a copy of it to your draw pile. I mean, this just draws two cards. And then it puts... Did someone say 10 hours of mooing? Yes, please. I also like rolling a D6, though. Rolling a D6 sounds kind of good. You could put that on top of red shift since we're going to play that all the time. You may spend 20 gold to suck at a gem. I kind of want to take that. Because rolling a D6 makes it so your next damage or block is increased by however much it rolls for. You could also take wave, uh, wave motion cannon. It goes really well in this fight coming up. Yeah, I think if you upgrade it, you get to you can you can suck at it twice. Which is interesting. But I also like exhaustive work of just drawing a card. Uh, you can't do it on card street because it has to cost one or more. I'm going to take it. Let's do it, man. Hey, guys. How's it going? Mm -hmm. Roll a d6. I rolled a four. Can you socket a card that upgrades to be zero cost? Probably. This reminds me of a friend I had that used to say, what's a finger up the ass when your whole fist is up there? Raise your strength to 11. He's not dead or anything. I just stopped talking to him because oh, he kept sure. bringing up fingers and asses. Right, I understand. Yeah, yeah. Deals six damage twice. Enemy loses four strength this turn. Penalty strike doesn't seem bad, especially with uh, rummage and also worker strike. Draw three cards, discard two, enter cunning. Cunning, when you enter the stance, gain two vigor for each unique debuff among all enemies. Interesting. I kind of like penalty strike, though. Strike of midnight's not terrible either. I think I'm going to take penalty strike. Stop! That's fine. Enhance. Put it on my red shift. Sick. All right. 18 damage. Enemy loses five strength for two mana. Seems okay, man. That seems okay. Oh, I had one more mana. What the hell? Just having a blast watching stuff on YouTube, but glad I caught you live today. Ooh. Hi. Flirt. You're forced to say Muda, Muda, Muda. You're forced to? Next turn, draw between zero and three cards. What the hell, man? Uh, this is not a good draw, is it? <laughs> We really could have drawn better than this, I think. <clears throat> really could have drawn better than this. <clears throat> uh. Is this one man? Is this literally? Oh no! You split at seventy-five now. I had split at seventy-five now. Why buy the cow when the milk is free? Right. Oh, we were still on low ascension where this guy had a low amount of stuff. Okay, slither again. Worker strike me another time. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Good split. It was just good because of the timing, not good because of the amount, but yes. All in. All in. Skip your next turn. I think we can deal with that. I think we can deal with a little bit of... 
all in. Teach a man how to milk, he'll have food for a day, but right. milk a man, and he yep. will remember you the rest of his life. Sure. Skip our next turn. What if I'm just getting debuffed. Into some comfy pajamas. True. Whenever you play a basic card, deal two damage to all enemies. I don't like the lack of a noise, but I'm happy with seeing all of these fun cards. End of your turn, shuffle one card from your hand into your draw pile. Interesting. You guys remember when I was about to die and then I only took like 10 damage in that combat? Boom! After image plus jug? Strikes bargain, deal six damage, reduce the cost of attacks in your hand to zero until played. Pick a card in your hand whenever you play it, deal 10 damage to uh, all enemies. Yeah, we're gonna take after image. Each turn after you play a card from four different packs, gain one energy. It's not a bad one, actually. Do I even have things from four different packs, though? <laughs> I sometimes do. One, two, three, four. Ah. Oh, no, but Retromation gives me like a billion different packs. Yeah, so no, that, that makes it that makes it really good. Yeah, Retromation makes it really good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, Retromation. 07's in chat. Mm -mm. What if we went like this? Oh, yeah, I like that. We could also go like this and go like super balls deep. Super balls? I'm going to go this way. Can someone explain 07 to me? Oh, 07. Yeah, it's supposed to be a salute. We could use more Let's energy. Play Pack Master. Oh, Takes okay. mostly original cards for Cleo. Shut up! He didn't pick Killer Queen. I'm gonna have a breakdown, breakdown. <clears throat> Look at how much fun we're having, though. Enter Venomous. Your attacks deal 50% less damage, but apply one weak and poison. Oh, two poison. Wait, that's actually kind of sick. I also don't mind a Gilly, because Gilly can be upgraded to cost zero. Um, the cunning doesn't really do anything, but the fact that I can shuffle a bunch of cards. What is Fallout? It is a debuff that's applied to enemies that then makes them take damage whenever you play powers. Chad, how do you say this Future if it's not Gilly? Suggestion. Gil? Can is it just Gil? With eight is it Guel? From is the it menagerie Guile? It's Guile? This is Guile? What does Guile mean? Anonymous, they give me a gift to one. What if we had a full JoJo's mod? There I'll is one. Get Congress on that there's, right now. No, there's there's already one. We've played it before. Thank you for subscribing. Sly or cunning? Mm. Oh, or what? <laughs> yeah, no, I think I'm gonna take this because if it costs zero as well, we can use it up for our collector's badge. Book? I'll read a book. Encridian. Well, like Empogian, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> We don't really have... I mean, these exhaust. Which is kind of incredible, right? Those cards exhaust. Other than that, we don't really have much. Could take the finesse. I really like the finesse, actually. Um, We could go this alternate path here. Go a safer act. This is just two combat stone, and then we get two good campfires. Okay. Double after image. Hold up. Let me cook. Did that just sound like... That just sounded like Diana saying moo, didn't it? Attacks in hand gain strike for this combat. Backstrike is kind of cool. 
Because it would combo well with Worker Strike if we actually had other attacks in our deck that said Strike. That didn't say Strike. Um, Evasive Tactics is interesting. It does Exhaust, which is interesting, but I'm not, I'm not looking for any of those, I don't think, right now. Energy Drink. Gain 10 Temporary HP. Gain 1 Duplication. For every 10 cards you... Gain 1 Duplication. For every 10 cards you shuffle into your draw pile. What? Is that like any time that I shuffle them? Like from now until the end of combat? Huh. I'm going to use this. I just want some block. I mean, yeah, it doesn't seem bad. It doesn't seem terrible. Deal 1 to 32 damage. Roll the X. Roll the damage X times and take the highest results. Was that 8? <laughs> Alright. Uh, blur is interesting. Steam barrier is also interesting. Stop just saying you're taking normal cards. Because I'm considering a blur or a steam barrier. Shut up. Shut up, chat. Rusty truly is default settings. Shut hey, up! Chat, he is a combo. I know it's so itchy this morning. Put it on an Oreo for instant cheesecake. Ew. Shut the fuck up. Don't say anything about it. Don't say anything about my decision making. Potions. Might rest here. Yeah, they am. Frost would take basic bitch cards, you default settings ass bitch. <sighs> She's so mad, man. YouTube title. I beat Packmaster with a default deck. It's not, it's not that good of a YouTube title. YouTube title. No. I beat it's not that, that, not that good of a YouTube title, honestly. Like, you, know, you could like make better ones, I guess, sometimes or something. Fuck, man. I need to play this. Maybe we use this here. Deal 10 damage to all enemies. Explosive. Vile. Can I find you explosive and vile? Oh, that's not very nice. YouTube title. Yo! Master, but it's just slave. Baylor Lord's Bash! Wait, I think we could actually probably pretty reliably play Baylor Lord's Bash. We have a small deck. If you guys don't know what this does, if you get off the entire cozy chair combo, every single card in your deck plays twice. YouTube title, I'm trying to beat Packmaster, but I'm a milk toast white boy. Okay. Now that we've gotten that out of our system, yeah? YouTube title, chat makes frost mold on a day when there's no incentive to make frost mold. Chat, stop bullying frost. Bullying with money is okay, chat. Ah! It scares me every time. Small adaptation. Any non choose a non power card that costs one or zero. Add a copy of it to your hand. You could do double Baylor Lord's Bash, or does it like give you three to choose from? Prep upgrade. Choose a skill or attack card. Add a copy of it to your hand. Yeah, you could do that for Baylor Lord's Bash, right? You could also do that to finesse. 
Now let's take a prep. I'm with you on that. Fuck, we're going a very risky path, I'm realizing now. <clears throat> That's not a strike. Raging Inferno. Okay. We get insta kill you. It's probably worth it. You freaking suck. Arson card? There is a card that's literally called Arson, so. Like, kind of close. I should have played the zero cost. I don't know what I was doing. Okay, okay. We just need to press end turn here so we heal the full. Mob bank, hello. I mean, body slam kind of fucks. But I'm also really wanting to, like, focus on getting my stuff off, and then it won't matter. You know? Like, it won't matter if we get it off. Or not. All right. We don't need to duplicate anything in this hands. Get it off. <laughs> my thoughts exactly, chat. Rainbow Louse. Oh, I remember the Rainbow Louse. It's so cute, man. The Rainbow Louse is so goddamn cute, man. We know, you know, we love you, you greasy little bozo. I'm, am I greasy now? I could take another D6. We are actually close to a campfire. We could take another D6. We could put it on like blur. Or we could put it on Gilly and then upgrade Gilly. Wait a second. We can test it out. Wait, let's take another D6. And then we... Explosive form! <laughs> at the start of each turn... Wait, at the start of each turn, set up the bomb? Take the grease right off your forehead, you sexy man. Mm Huh? We we killed you. And they deal four damage, apply four vulnerable exhaust. It's kind of a fun card if, if we were doing something like that. Okay, enhance this onto Guile and then upgrade Guile. Hey yo. It fucking works? What? The heck? What if we just created like a hundred blurs? Mm -hmm. Have you never played Street Fighter before? No. Had a copy of the last different color card played into your hand. Give it ethereal. I probably have at some point played Street Fighter. What a boss. Well. It is going quite well, I would say, yeah. The perfect time to get off Valor Lord's Bash, too. Malkazar's Imp. Whenever a non imp carded is exhausted, add one imp to your discard pile. Oh, wait, I had fucking comfy blueprint. Oops. <laughs> mm. 
Mm -hmm. Am I just gonna die now? Like, actually, am I gonna die? I thought I was just, like, good to go, but it doesn't look like I'm good to go anymore. Did I fuck up? No, because uh, next turn we're going to get uh, penalty strikes. Next turn we get penalty strike, and we'll be fine. Trust me. Trust me. In one orb slot. Hold on, I need to change or change the battery in my headset. Comfy? Uh, uh, we could comfy here, but I would like to not. Because I would like... Uh, we're not on Ascension Zero where we just gain all of our health back. So we do have to kind of care. After image, please. I mean, if we're just wanting to continue to combo with Juggernaut, you just take Frost Orbs, man. If you just get Frost Orbs... What is this? A cult can be played disregarding any conditions for playability. Cards played this way are exhausted. Oh! Wait, that's so cool! So if, like, I have a debuff that doesn't allow me to play attacks, I could play it, but then it would exhaust. If I didn't have enough energy, I could play it, then it would exhaust. It's interesting. It's super cool. My only issue with taking my own card is it's expensive. That is my issue with taking my own card. It is quite the expensive one. Yeah, but content. We've played with my card like a hundred times. Throw some fucking balls. All right. Uh, empty cage. Not bad, not bad. The rare tiny house pick. No, if we didn't have a potion, I'd consider it, but... This deck likes to be really, really tiny. Keeping it under 20 cards feels great. And look at that. There's the Burning Elites. Thank you for subscribing. Into Glad another potential one. To enjoy the pack master. Absolutely. Fun packs you've got there. Some fun packs you've got there, Tristan. Thank you for subscribing. TY, TY. Madargo, thank you for the three months. Anonymous Gifter, thank you for gifting one to Olive. Yeah, we literally can have triple after image since all we ever get is after image off of the Incridian. <laughs> Ooh! You guys want to take a body slam now? Stop saying that I'm only taking the cards from the regular game. Shut up! Shut up! There is a second shot, but it's really far away. I don't think we can take that. Only giving me after images and feel no pains. This is not okay, man. It's making me look bad. You know that, right? It's making me look bad. Look at the cool combo, though. Poggers, poggers, poggers. Who would take poggers if you're impressed? I also got a turnip, which is incredible. Uh, I don't need any of these, I don't think. A waffle. Gold in cold and calculated. Deals eight damage. Apply frostbite and her cunning. Hmm. Not a terrible card. Aquamarine. Channel one frost. Should we take an aquamarine? I could remove rummage here. Doesn't seem that good anymore. Could Remember remove rummage. The start when Jumi asked how many subs for a shard run. Little did he know you do it for free. This isn't shard. Shard gives you access to 700 plus cards. It doesn't just give you access to the basic cards of the, the standard game. Ah. I could take this. We just don't have a place to socket it anytime soon. And it make, that makes me nervous. So I don't think I will. <laughs> I do think I'll take the waffle though. And a pendant. Oh. Ricky man, thank you for the seven. Thank you for subscribing. Sup, sup. Thanks. T-Y, T-Y. That's really on one today. 
something like that. Take five damage. No thanks. Strikers, a bargain. <laughs> oh man, let me see the fun stuff, dude. The This is the fun stuff. Yeah, well, I don't have as much fun when it's just Chad being mean to me, you know? You know what I'm saying? Arsenal gear at the start of your next turn at a random uncommon or rare card to your hand. It costs zero. Rhapsody. Dude, I'm never going to be able to get off the Baylor Lords thing just because I kill things too fast. Ain't 10 feral. Yeah, do you feel very feral today? Because you seem very feral today. Toxicology. And they're venomous. And uh, draw three cards. If you're in venomous, exit it and gain two energy instead. That's an interesting card. That's actually pretty interesting. You get a lot of value out of that sometimes. Countdown, though. Countdown doesn't draw Not you five cards. In a feral kind of way. Uh -huh. I just like the ability to gain energy sometimes. Imagine if we get a footwork, too. Yo, thank you so much, Grumpy Gilly. Can we all say nice things? Like, just go around and take turns. Saying fun and nice things. About our favorite streamer. Whether or not that's me. Not even saying it's me. I'm not even saying that I could be that person. I'm not, I'm not like, being a pretentious douchebag like that. We bully because we love Jesus fuck. Jesus fuck. You just like it when he says Jesus fuck. You don't, you don't. So. I would say nice things about you, but then you say hey take one of these fricks so it really is the path of getting bullied or bullying. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. It's fair. Fun fact. This is the first time Just 50 gold told or strength push. I appreciate him as a streamer and he didn't tell me to eat shit or take one of these fricks. <laughs> you deal 100% more non-attack damage? Streamer, you are my favorite. Holy shit. Wait, that's insane, dude. He have to bully you now cause we don't know crush the industry enough to backseat and bully you. That makes that deal 14 damage. What the Hello, fuck? Also, oh, I'm gonna die. Mother, 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 mother. We need to hit him. Mount Frost, you have beautiful curly hair. Mr. Frost, I may be able to count the pixels on my screen with one foot, but you look good today. Mr. Frost, your voice is soothing. Mr. Frost, uh -huh. you never scam yep. smile. Never have. I don't think I do scam. I don't think I ever have. Not a single time have I ever scammed. Max, max HP loss. Explosive form.
Like, I know that we're doing 50% reduced attack damage, but, like, I don't fucking care. Auto battler. No. <laughs> Wait, no, that actually wouldn't be bad, would it? We could probably play auto. No, we, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to play auto battler. Mr. I don't care Frost, what you say. You can get frost orbs. I could get frost orbs. Yeah. Adrenaline bomb. Think of the prime. Olive. Think of the five gift. Jesus. Will you play a glo gold glowing card? Gain one strength. After five triggers, gain two decks. This is too easy, man. This shit is too fucking easy. Too fucking easy, man. Too motherfucking easy. I'll tell you what. I kind of want to upgrade this, but we won't have the ability to. Let's take another feel no pain, but it's not that necessary. It's not that necessary to have multiple of them. Energy drink. Do, 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 do. Would you say that this run is easy? No, I am having to focus like a little bit just to make sure that I don't blunder anytime. Chat likes to think that I blunder all the time. I don't believe that. Angel, first time chatter, what's going on? You know what? You know what I'm gonna do, chat? I'm gonna get off Baylor Lords. Never mind, no, I'm not. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Eve of destruction! It's just taking a second juggernaut, really, but, like, it's kind of fun to do. Yeah, I'm definitely going to click on this. Uh, that's kind of a little bit late for that one. Dummy strike. Reduce debuffs by one. That's interesting. Nuclear fusion. Play a card in your hand with, an, with a cost of X plus one or lower twice. Add X burns to your hand. Wait! <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. This is okay for us because we can just play the burns. They add to my hand and then also those burns exhaust, which then if they exhaust, they also trigger Juggernaut. I'm going to take a blur too. I'm going to take a gilly too. Sorry, guile, guile, guile. Kristen, it's fucking guile. Every time you say gilly, I punch my monitor. I think deep breath is also very good. Sometimes. Kristen, ah. <clears throat> you don't understand. I'm about to fucking throw up, man. Eve of Destruction. Wait, that also increases our letter opener damage. Do you think about that? Chad, have you thought about that? That also increases letter opener damage to being 10 damage. Metallic Vile. Gain 4 plated armor. Gain 3 thorns. Or 2 artifact. Mm -hmm. Boom! It's incredible. 60 damage. If it doesn't kill an enemy, add a despair to your hand. I do not want to be in despair.
Like I could, man. It's just expensive, okay? And we're literally going up against the spooky guy for powers, all right? He's right there. Is he looking cute? Yeah. Is he looking awesome? Yeah. Is he one of the best cards in the game? Yeah. But I don't need to win another run with me, okay? We know that I'm OP. We know that I can win if I have myself, all right? It's like King Arthur winning with Excalibur. It's like, you know that it's going to happen. But instead, it'd be cooler if he didn't. You know what I'm saying? It could be cooler if he just was able to win. Just off of being really, really fucking cool. I'll just play it. Just get out of here. Don't question mark me, champ. Don't ever question mark me ever again. Wait, we could double preparation here. There's not really anything to prep. Nice. There is a lot of incoming damage. But check this shit out, man. Fucking dead! Legendary carpet. Thank you for gifting us up. You managed to avoid playing yourself. Good job. Thanks. Clap. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let him cook. Clap. Stop. Cal. Choose a card from your draw pile, play it, and exhaust it. Your cards now play twice. Wow, that was so good. I did it. I got off the cozy chair. Holy shit. That was so helpful. Thank you, Baylor Lord. Everybody say thanks, Baylor Lord. For such an incredible pogged up. Holy. Thank you so much, Baylor. Appreciate that one, bud. I'm going to upgrade prep now. Yeah, that's Mr. Lord to you, chat. Uh, removal is good. I think draw potions actually way better. It's kind of cool. came first, the streamer or ah, it was me. Uh huh. You did. Oh, I. I now understand what you're saying. I understand. I wish I wasn't. I wish I hadn't realized what you were referring to there. Two yeah. thump, two thump, two thump. Yep. It's really annoying that we didn't get to keep any of that. <clears throat> Still taking no damage, though, which is uh, quite incredible if you ask me. Boom, 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 boom. Quick, Baylor Lord all over them. Quick, play your gilly. I mean, this is just one mana most turns. <laughs> all right. Do you think our deck's pretty good? <laughs> yeah, I think... Uh... Double Eve of Destruction. That makes... That means... It says 200%. So that means that this will deal... Uh, 15 damage, right?
Yeah, it's just 3x. Oh, yeah, and our thorns. Wait, that's going to be nine thorns? Oh, incredible. Wait, we could just play nuclear fusion? On feel no pain? Get a thousand burns. <laughs> Probably not that good. Drop potion me. All right. So wait, if if I were to nuclear fusion juggernaut here, the juggernaut would be 14 and it would deal 14 times would deal would deal 14 times a billion. Incredible. I don't think it's necessary though. I do think I want to nuclear fusion the feel no pain. I don't think it's the best thing to do. Just because of... Uh... Well, no, if I nuclear... Chad, if I nuclear fusion, it would have been 14 times 3. It wouldn't have been... It would have been 14 times 3, not, not 7 times 3. Because there would have been two... would have been two uses of the... You know what I'm saying. You get it. You get it. It was 135 just from Thorn. Good. Good. Don't worry, guys. We could get Baylor Lord's bash off. <laughs> Chad, I used it once. Am I allowed to put it in the title of the video or no? Am I allowed to put it? Am I allowed to clickbait it? Yes or no? Ah. <laughs> uh. I used ba Okay, hold on. But the thing is is I would put this in the in the video, which I did use in like every fight. I did use in like every time that I had it. Did I get off the cozy chair? No. But I did use Baylor Lord's Beige. YouTube title. I no just chair, no better better gamer chair. I used it once. I used it once. I used gamer chair one single time. And it was awesome. <laughs> Put blur and after image in the title. Oh, no, I'm not gonna no. Hold on. <laughs> Now, I don't know if blur and after image would be the best for getting the people to uh, click on the run. I don't know. <laughs> mother, mother, good vid. Oh, thanks, man. Wonder, can you get him to say muda muda? Maybe if you do M O O D. 